but you are quite involved in many things. Your foundation is very busy. I have been invited to speak to some of the scholars. Yes. You've done some advocacy also within the foundation for RISE. What was the idea behind setting up a foundation for leadership development? After it's your... part of the legacy I want to leave to posterity. I had a very long public service life. I went into public service in my 20s. That's long ago in the 1960s. I don't know if how old you were then. But uh, um, I'm a lawyer basically. But at the age of 27, I went into uh, uh, local government service, becoming the town clerk or city manager of the second city of Ghana, and which office I held for three years uh, before going into parliament, becoming a member of parliament. Uh, 19. 69 at the age of 30 and then at the same time being made appointed uh, deputy foreign minister of ghana and i stayed in there of course with the interruptions or incursions by the military into governance i also uh, went into business and uh, it's been so politics business uh, until I became president of our nation in uh, 2001, holding the office uh, as constitution provided twice, and retiring exactly on my 70th birthday Wow! Uh, 2008. So you spent at least 11 years as a former president? No, the constitution allows only eight years. Eight years. So Four-year terms twice. So I'm saying, as, so as a former president? As a former president, uh, it's now, is it? Since 2008. So 12 years. Entering your 13th year. 13 years. What is distinct about Kufour's idea of leadership? What's the most important philosophy in your leadership approach? Um, when you are called a leader, you are a leader of whom or what? Uh, but to me, it's a leader of men and women, of course. And uh, so everything to me a leader should do, a leader of people should be human-centered to try to better the lot of uh, the people the leader is privileged to lead. And if it's in governance and it's democratic, then you should, leaders should always be mindful that the real power, sovereignty really resides with the people because it, democratically it's the people who give the power to you. And if that's the case, the term servant leader is the principle by which a leader should be motivated and guided through a period of service to the people. And as a political leader, how important is the people's response? I know people like Professor Adair have said leadership is cause, everything else is effect. In leading people in a political sphere, how much of it depends on the leader and how much depends on the people? Um, I don't want to separate the leader from the people he leads. A leader who hasn't got the following is not a leader. It's just a, somebody perhaps gallivanting or wandering off. Mm. Uh, so a leader should be like hooked, linked mm -hmm. with the people uh, he leads. And um, <laughs> you quoted Professor Adair, cause and effect. No, no, no. Mm. Uh, of course, leaders should know the people mm. thoroughly, uh, the aspirations, the, uh, the hardships, the challenges of people. The country must know the lay of the land. And of course, he must be a visionary. Uh, understanding the problems of it and then uh, sort of envisioning the aspirations where the people want to go mm. or what he can convince the people to do to this is the way we should go please come along with me if they should fall back then he comes alone and he's not a leader so they move together because if the people should decide to fall back or abandon him then 
whom would he be leading to where? Mm -hmm. So I, I think uh, they are hooked and they, they must work together. Mm -hmm. So uh, realization. Uh, of course, nobody can do it all, but at least given the constitutional tenure, for instance, the four year terms, by the end of uh, the term, the leader should be able to say to himself that uh, the assignment he was given by the people, he managed to work towards realizing it to such and such a point. And the people should be, in a way, satisfied. Otherwise, like in our constitution, where a leader could work two terms, the leader may not have mm. the renewal of mandate from the people for the second term. So it's all like 